So one of the big topics at this IWC Law meeting is indeed optimizing therapy in the frontline setting. We're fortunate now in CLL that we have many effective options, and so really we're starting to discuss more around the specifics of particular patients. What are their comorbidities? What is, what's their age and what are the goals of, of treatment? Is this an older patient where maybe we use a continuous BTK inhibitor-based strategy and they end up dying of something else in a few years? Uh, or is this a younger fit patient where we may need to plan for decades of treatment and we might want to use a more aggressive strategy where we combine agents together? Uh, we have venetoclax, which is a great backbone for our time-limited therapies. And we're trying to understand now, should we be combining BTK inhibitors with venetoclax? Or should we be combining CD20 antibodies with venetoclax? We have approved regimens now with, with both. Uh, we're trying to compare these now in various head-to-head -head studies. Uh, and then, you know, the question of chemoimmunotherapy is still one that, that comes up, especially in countries around the world where they may not have as much access to the targeted therapies. Uh, so that's also under discussion at this meeting. So a lot to discuss, uh, a lot of data still being generated in this area. And I think we're continuing to move toward improved therapies for our patients in the frontline setting.